Hey, this is Sean Holbrook with OVR Magazine, and behind me is my 2023 Jeep Wrangler 392, and I wanted to show you one of my favorite accessories. That's the Banks iDash and the new Stealth Pod. So let me fire it up, and I'll uh, take you inside and show you what it does. So here we are inside my 392, and I wanted to point out where the iDash gauge is mounted. So while we talk about that, I'll fire it up. It never gets old. All right, you'll see the iDash come alive here, and where it's mounted is in the Banks Stealth Pod. Now, there's gonna be a Stealth Pod available for this upper part of the grab handle or the lower. So if you've got an accessory up here, uh, like I have one down here, eventually they'll be offering a bottom mount one as well. But for now, the top mount one is amazing. Uh, the only competition out there that offers a, a pod that mounts in this area for your standard aftermarket gauge uh, they mount it up here in the window and it requires some epoxy and some other stuff and it doesn't allow full use of your sun visor. So that's huge on the Banks product is not only do I get the information I want, but I've got full use of my sun visor. Now, what I love about the iDash is, let's say if I go to off-road mode or off-road pages, what'll happen is the screen will change and it'll give you a whole bunch of different parameters that you can look at. So right now the screen is changing, you're going to off-road pages, Except when you do that, it covers up your maps, it covers up uh, your Pandora, it covers up your Apple CarPlay, it covers up your um, radio, whatever you're listening to. So the nice thing is I have coolant temp, oil temp, battery voltage, trans temp, oil pressure, but it's covering everything up. I can do up to eight different parameters on multiple pages on an iDash. So for here, I've got engine coolant temp, engine oil temp, transmission temp, uh, ambient air temperature, uh, intake air temperature, battery voltage, and fuel all up here. And I can program those and, and modify it to whatever I want to see on multiple pages. And so what's awesome about that is I get the same info and even more than what Jeep offers on this screen or my driver's information center at the same time I'm doing other things. It just plugs right into your OBD2, it pulls out the CAN information, and it's plug and play, there's nothing else you need to do. There's two versions of the iDash. This is a data monster, which means it has this little card slot here, so you can actually store data and you can data log. So if you're having an issue or something like that, or you wanted to see what your, your vehicle is doing. The other thing, I also have max temps on here as well. So you can set limits, and you can also scroll over to the min max log, and check this out, my maximum engine coolant, my my maximum engine oil temp, my maximum trans temp, all that, all those parameters that I have set up there, I can look in the min max as well. And you can customize the gauge to almost any color that you want the buttons to be, both the physical hard buttons or also the surrounds here as well. I'm a huge fan of the iDash, I love it. I think for Jeeps and especially watching all of your cooling and all your temps and thermally managing everything, it's a great product to have. And the benefit also is if you have a pedal monster installed, which is a great product also from Banks, it's the only one with active safety, it goes back to stock and reverse. Basically it's a pedal, you know, uh, calibrator that makes the vehicle feel a little bit more lively and you don't have to dip as far into the pedal, all that kind of good stuff. Normally you would set it on your Bluetooth app on your phone. If you've got a iDash, you can switch over and I can adjust my sensitivity while still seeing three parameters on the side of it. And all of this is super customizable. So if you've got a Jeep Wrangler, a Jeep Gladiator, uh, and you're out on the trail, highly recommend getting yourself an iDash, especially with the new Stealth Pods because there isn't a better option out there for having a gauge. And most gauges only show you a few things. There's hundreds of parameters that you can find right here in a uh, in iDash from Banks. So anyway, great product. Uh, just thought I would share it with you guys and tell you how much I love it. Yeah, head over to bankspower.com if you are interested in picking one up for your setup.